What's up guys? Chandler here with Rise Magic and today we're going to go over our top five two-handed cuts. Now these are cuts that we love to perform ourselves so snuggle up, grab a warm blanket because we've got the fire going right now. We're going to show you five incredible, amazing two-handed cuts. Now by far the most important two-handed cut to know is the sidewall cut. Now, this is a foundation for pretty much every other two-handed cut out there that's usually will be a flirt, a uh, variation of Seibel. The best and most detailed tutorial that we could find was on 52 Cards channel. We will have that link below, so be sure to check it out. So second, we have Squoz by Elliot Solven. I'm not sure if that's how you say his name, but it looks something like that. Now, there is a free tutorial for this move on his personal YouTube channel. That's where I learned it from, and I think it's a really nice two-handed cut that looks flashy, and it's not that difficult for you to learn. So, link in the description if you wanna check it out right now. Oh, and yes, by the way, these are the first edition verts that were ran over by about eight cars in the how to catch a card in the fan tutorial, and they're fine. So stop getting mad at me. So next up, we have Phased by Tobias Levin. Now this is actually by far, by absolute far, my favorite two-handed cut. What I love about it is that you can do it as a cycle, do it two times in a row, maybe you can do it three times in a row. I think that spinning pack in the middle makes it look extra flashy and I always get crazy reactions when I perform for people. Now this tutorial is on Tobias Levin's actual personal YouTube channel, not the dealer script channel. So the link to that will be in the description below. And while this is a hard move, I highly suggest learning it. I really think it is the best two-handed cut ever. Now, I could not complete this top five without doing Barlow 2 by Nikolaj Peterson. Now, I'm not entirely sure that's how you say his name, but it's foreign, so I can be an ignorant American and just say it how I want to. Just kidding. But if you want to learn it, I'm leaving the link to the tutorial in the description. I'm pretty sure this costs money, um, but it's a great move. It was move of the year in 2016 at the Karshikan. So I really do think it's worth your time learning. It's super easy to learn, but it looks hard to lay in. So check it out. I'm just getting some vibes in this manic man. It's all about the vibes. Vibes. All right, now the last two-handed move we have for you guys is The Worm by Dan and Dave. Now this was created just to be a cool different way to make a quick five pack of production. And it's a lot of fun to do. The best tutorial that we were able to find for it other than the one that was originally on Dan and Dave's trilogy DVD, is on the Russian Geniuses YouTube channel. We'll have a link to that in the description below. Now, when Chandler and I were discussing this video, one thing, what I really wanted to do was just plug every single two-handed original cut that I had made already on Rise Magic. But, as tempting as it was, we decided to show you the five two-handed cuts that we thought would be the most useful and are our favorite that we think you guys should learn. So, of course, as always, check them out. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like, and comment down below and tell us if you think there was any two-handed cuts that we missed. But as always, Grant and Chandler behind the camera from Rise Magic, we will see you in the next video.